One, two, ten! Hi! Hello! Hi. We are the Normies, everybody. We are back to watch season nine, episode ten of The Walking Dead. Heck yeah! And it's, it's, it's called... It's Omega. called Omega. Woo, woo, woo! And Omega level threat. This is an oh, Omega shit. three is good for is you. Is that the worst one? I think so. Or is it the demon level? I don't even Omega know. Omega Is this One Punch? I don't remember. I don't know. Demon on Which, I'm just, I don't even know what reference I'm making anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, uh, last time we, we talked a little too much. Our apologies. Did we? I don't know. The comments said we were chatty Cathy's, and I guess we did miss that Daryl kind of knew Henry was going to talk to Lydia at the end there. Did something. we? Yeah, apparently that happened. Okay. Like he was waiting outside the vent. Apparently they were in cahoots together. So that is one big thing we missed. But... I know Sadiq got Rosita pregnant. Come yeah, on. Like, we no, heard we, that. We, we that. And we on top that. of that, we talked about it. I kind yeah. of feel like Carol didn't listen to us talk about it. Even though it's recorded history now. Like, as it happened, not in the discussion. Like, we talked about it when it was happening. But it was cut. Well, yeah. You didn't so. cut it, did you? I don't think so. No, 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 no. no. I, I raised my hand because <laughs> Sadiq, my boy. Yeah, yeah. I patted you on the back of that. Yeah, Rosita. Holy shit. Because I know that Serge would like to get Rosita pregnant. Oh, you know. Oh, my God. Like, here's the third Sadiq. Yeah. You, you, think, you think Rosita liked the like no liked his Sadiq? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know where I was going. I know we're on the same page. Regardless, this time we'll we'll be a little less chatty, and we will try to pay more attention for you because we we legitimately listen to you guys. You know. So what about you guys? You you, you enjoying this? this yeah, this run? yeah. It's honestly season the mid season nine is not what I'm expecting so far, and I'm, I like it. I like Poor Negan over here. Trying Poor to... Negan. Yeah. Honestly, uh, I didn't think, I didn't think my heart would ever Poor break Negan. for Negan, but it is now. Just two years ago, he was bashing Glenn's brains in. Speaking of which, I'm going to go get Lucille. Why you guys talk about right back? Lucille. Just, um, <laughs> just seeing Negan in like, his old like factory and all that shit, keeping that one like friend zombie of his. I'm like, this oh, is yeah. just so sad. That was sad, yeah. yeah. He was never his friend, though. That's I don't the think. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Did but we have found... any friends like mm. in the Saviors, or was he just... Um, I would, leader. I would say the, the, the leaders were the closest, right? Yeah, yeah. Like, but were uh, they close, though? Yeah, this guy, Simon. The closest yeah. to being a friend, but I don't yeah. know if they were friends. He ended up choking him out. Yeah. And we learned Judith is, Judith is this one little baddie. Judith is the most rootinest, tootinest cowgirl <laughs> this side of the Mississippi. <laughs> well, well guys, uh, I hope you're watching this on AMC. Mm -hmm. You know, support the original content. And uh, nice. check out the Uncut on our Patreon. Support us. Check out our gaming channel. Check out our podcast channel. Check Merch. out all that stuff. Yep. If you guys want to see us dance like idiots every Friday, go to the gaming channel where we do a live stream dancing. Every Friday. It's every as ridiculous Friday. as it sounds. Sometimes we get drunk. We were a bicycle last time. Last yes. time, fried chicken and beer was a bad combo. Oh, God. Yeah. You guys did fried chicken and beer and then dance? For two hours. <laughs> Who made the, the decision same, on that? Right before you guys came to Parks and Rec? Mainly Chris, I guess. We were exhausted. It kind of was mainly me. I guess I'm the chicken and beer guy. Racism. <laughs> oh, this bitch! Uh -huh. <laughs> but like... Lydia. Yeah, it's Lydia. Honestly... Lydia. I think she's playing them very good. You're a lie. Flashback? Yeah, I haven't seen one of these in a while. I think it's uh, Lydia's peoples. That's Lydia, bro. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Oh my god. Did she kill him? Yeah. Maybe. No. I think the mom did it. Yeah, her mom. You don't mess with her either. Bro. Bro. Uh, Lydia's yeah. mom offed him off probably because he was gonna like off the kid. <laughs> uh, or maybe he was trying to like go outside or some shit, or maybe I don't maybe know. Maybe he was wife beating. So it was quiet, but me and Sirich one hundred percent noticed what I'm gonna consider a full on breaking bad. Uh, What's the song? Out. Runner's not there yet. I know, she's not so. I heard you guys whisper, the song, the song, the song. Yeah. Lydia, Lydia, have you met Lydia? <laughs> that song's from uh, a certain part of Breaking Bad yeah, by a certain yeah. person. Got it. Well, it's an awful song. Yeah. One of the songs awful. Unless you like someone named Lydia and you can say her name. I don't know any Lydia's. I don't know any Lydia's. What about either. Lydia Dietz? Who? Yeah, I think I think the husband was beating Lydia's mom. Cause Maybe like Carol. They compared her to Carol. Yeah. yeah. I mean, he was like staring at Lydia though, like, "Oh, you child, you're not gonna make it." <clears throat> what? I wouldn't be surprised if he abused a child. Ugh. Maybe the prank. 
So like, what is it made out of? I really like this. It's like stretched out pantyhose. Ooh, get it. Woo! All right. She's me with a knife. God, my heart's pounding. Well, the one of them is gonna die. Yeah. Yeah. Now horses. Yeah, and poor horses. How'd you manage to just? Yeah. Connie says the horses will cut open. The skin will not. Oh. This wasn't just a bed. She's a liar. There could be three more of them out there. There could be three hundred of them yep. out there. We head back, we stay behind the walls, and we make a plan. Yeah. Until yep. we yep. find out what this is. Go, Tara. She said what we're not we leaving without Luke. We will. Let's go. Damn. Mm -hmm. Damn. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Lay down the law, Tara. Don't you ever suggest that I don't care about my kid. Bitch. <laughs> is Halloween coming up? I think I found my costume. Shut I can be this. Oh my god. This is where she gets the idea. Every day is Halloween, baby. <gasps> Whoa! You've taken a giant leap. Okay. It was just a menacing shot. He's shaving. No oh shaving in the apocalypse, baby. You always liked it. You know what I want now. <laughs> shaving my beard with scissors. They're the leaders of another community. No, you don't supposed to say that. Where I'm from. Is it called? Oh, Come on, shut no. up! Please. It's called the Kingdom. Oh! Here's a map. Days ride from here. <laughs> That's yep. what Daryl was like. All right. <laughs> she's, she's never. She's never getting out of there now. Yep. Uh, I was like, I let this play out long enough. Yeah, they were definitely yeah, not in Cahoots because on. your time is up, Henry. That's what's going on. Just, you serve your two-day sentence. Yeah. Now it's time to educate Henry. But there's more her people out there. Yeah, stupid. You're a family at the kingdom. I'm sorry. Wait, you were listening? Mm -hmm. Of course we were. See? Okay. <laughs> Only Daryl. You can switch it. You're an asshole. Oh my you want answers? Get them yourself. Henry, you haven't even seen her face. I right? know, right? Are you going back into the prison? No. <laughs> no way. This, the theme of the season is walk back to yourself. Kilvars went missing. Would she kill him? She would if she had to. She would if she had to. Why would you? Bro. Yeah, I'll be damned if I'm gonna chew his cards. You're gonna crack his neck, bro. She's not sure I'm gonna do that. You hear me? You hear me? Oh, she's got her arm on his neck. She was suffocating him. Did you hear that snap? Yeah. She cried. I did hear a little cut. Yeah, yeah, she snap. heard his. Uh, oh, she could crush his windpipe, bro. Yeah. And this is the start of the revolution. First blood. She's got a taste for Well, he's gonna turn, right? Yeah. He should, canonically, but. Well, it takes a minute. Now he's the one sticking to her. <laughs> and the mom is like the scary one. Mm -hmm. He did a good job with scissors. Yeah, <laughs> damn. <laughs> almost, almost impossibly good job. Well, you think I'm gonna hit you with it or something? Yes. Yes. For real? Break her fucking arm off. You thought. This bitch is crazy. What are you gonna do through that? I know, right? I guess you had to try, I guess. They're trying to go find Luke. Yeah, it's their dude. I get it. Who else? Right or die. That's how we got here, so we keep that. We need to. He's a cutie. Alright. Y'all made it this far. Just to be the shit out of their kids. Oh, is it a switch? Snip? What is it? Switch. Switch? A good switch hmm? from a birch tree. Troy's mom from your dad sounds a lot like one of those dads. Choice grandma. Yeah. Except the part where he sang to you when you were scared. Thing is, that's the only part of your story that didn't sound like bullshit. So let me ask you, if your dad's dead, who gave him to you? Her mama started mm -hmm. being here? My mom. Make sure she's staying alive. Why are you protecting her? This place isn't real. The world changed and you're all acting like it's gonna change back. She does for a reason. Your mom beats you. Because she loves you. We need to get him out before he starts to smile. Oh. We should wait till morning. Her scissor cut her. didn't go well. She had like patches though, right? Her hair? I mean, that's uh -huh. if you try to cut your hair with scissors, that's pretty much what's gonna happen. I like the casting for the mom. Come here. He has his beard back? Wait. Because the mom liked it. Yeah, like, that dude was just, just dead, right? Just, he just died, right? It was a different guy. That was the same guy. The dead guy was a different guy. No, no, no it wasn't. It was the same guy. Oh, maybe since it's Lydia telling the story, she's lying and changing parts. 
like inconsistency. Yeah. Turning again. He's gonna sit up. <gasps> he does the same guy there. It wasn't that Oh yeah, yeah it, it, is. it is. It's a different guy. It's a different dude. It's, no, it's a different guy. It's a different guy. It's the God. same guy. It's, it's a different guy. guy. It's the same guy. I don't know anymore. It's the same guy. Oh, oh, no. No. oh my no. God! That's how you went. No. It's your fault. No. Hey, I told you what happened to me. Tell me what happened to you. No, Fuck please. off. You're the one in the prison. That'll take eight and a half seconds. Hey. Tell me! Oh, they're sneaking out. Good for them. I mean, you know, it, Daryl's gonna die. it's not a good plan, you know, logically, but yeah. I understand. Yeah, at least they're right today. Does he know how to come through that door quietly? <laughs> just punch you it. You could have just asked me to help. He's listening on well, the was Henry hey, listening. What's gonna happen to her? Hopefully, die. Nah, I'm done Did someone used to beat you up too? She's a trade to be done. Yeah, that, that's what I thought. I thought it'd be his dad. Was beating him. I heard my dad ask my mom why she kept her hair so short. She said when it was long, her first husband would grab it when she tried to get away. She just cut it all off. So he couldn't. Karen? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I guess it took her this long to feel safe again. Dead. Wow. I didn't think about that. You can show her there's nothing to be afraid of. He did already. You can do that. I know, right? I don't trust Lydia. No, not at all. He brought her pills and tried to give her water. She definitely lied. She like attempted to stab him in the arm. Lydia. She has a chance. It's not like they've been threatening her this whole time. They're trying to have a conversation with her. Yeah, they kind of threatened her last time. No, they're not. Time. When? They were like, you don't start talking, then we're going to fucking throw you out to the wolves. They did. Daryl held a knife in her face. Okay, well, she still deserved it. They were trying to kill them. Our choice was not to die. Was it? Or is that what we keep telling ourselves? <laughs> so, are zombies the most quietest motherfuckers on the planet? Until they're not. <laughs> they are. Sneaky zombie, man. <laughs> Super size up until he was right yeah. up on them. You guys are about to be surrounded because you're fucking around with the brightest flashlights possible. I know, man. Turn off the flashlight. Duh! Sure thought about that before you left. It though. was your idea! Okay, I thought she was totally gonna be there. Yeah, I thought she was gonna get me too. There's too much space on the left. Can we not have this conversation? Oh my god! No! No! Don't say yes to that! This is a dumb fuck decision now. Oh Can my I get god, back? it's fucking stupid! They're having a stupid. moment. They're having a moment here. No! No. It's a life or death you moment though. You cannot have and a moment in a There are like enemies this. watching in the bushes. So, no. Survival! Uh, yep. First! Yep. yep. Conversation! Second! You also oh, dumb God. motherfuckers. They're following them back. Oh my God. So fucking they just dumb. Just sit there in the trees, all creepily and shit. Oh my God. Like the Titans when they're not moving at night. You know if you let her out, you little piece of shit. He's not gonna let her out. Good boy. Guys, young love works in mysterious ways. He likes a dirty girl. She's oh, pretty shit. dirty. No! And I want to show you that this is a good place. Yep. You fucking idiot! She has a hook. She's gonna stab you. No, maybe Daryl's in on this fight. She's gonna bash you over the head. The first chance she gets, she's gonna eat you. She said, "Don't be soft. Soft people are mean." Mm -hmm. Whack! Oh, okay. And you gonna turn your back on her, dog, bro? Like her other people are outside, knowing where this place is now. He's showing her insides and out. Like, fuck it. Yeah, right? Just give him a map. Unless he's in, in on it with Daryl and this is a test. Eat it. Is it a worm? Oh. Oh. Hot. A dirty worm. Kiss well, that mouth. Hey. <laughs> no such thing as a clean worm. Bro, just how does she even know they're like just Ugh. the birthday? They're just like, oh. Ugh. A worm sensor. Is he going to eat it to show like, hey, no. I can hang? Yeah. No. Peer pressure. Trying okay, to impress cool. the girl. I'll eat the worm. Oh! oh. She might eat your worm. Oh, she liked it for him. She ate the turtle. Oh, weird oh, flex, but okay. Don't do it. <laughs> no! Why? Oh! The power of boners is strong in this one. Henry will do anything for her. It's, it's official. Chris Marquette, I gotta see you guys do this. Dies. This is how Chris Marquette met. Yeah. <laughs> Why would you think that? I baby birded her a worm. Oh! <laughs> that is the, uh, the medical trailer. Oh! 
Oh my damn it! Where's that map? You idiot! Where's here's the map? Here's who lives here. Here's who lives here. Doctor. Oh! Blacksmith, cobbler, you name it, we got it. Oh Please don't God. pick up that. Please don't kill Henry. Henry's gonna get bludgeoned. Oh, this... <gasps> Daryl's watching. Oh, this is like, that's not supposed to exist. Why is this it's like, it's, it, it's weirding Your her out. They said they couldn't, that's why they had to. That's why we. That's why what? Brainwashed her. World's over. You're doing what I want now. Oh. Oh. I heard that. I didn't hear what she was muttering then. I don't think she said that. I, heard, I thought she was saying she's a good mom. It was unintelligible. So, her mom, the, her story is all fucked up. Okay. Yeah, she's got PTSD. I feel for her now. Oh, I still don't. Yeah, I still don't. She's a third person. She yeah. was about to, she must oh, have slam oh. him in the she head. She was one baby but cry away from up in the head. She killing was, Henry. She was like, this is his... And Henry's about to be fucked up in the head, too. She was one baby cry away from bludgeoning his head. In. Wait, can you stay with me tonight? Oh. None of this would have happened if Eden would have just gotten with Henry instead of all of them. Hold hands. Or you just do bars. You know they're stab, gonna. Stab, stab, stab. You know they're gonna. Hold hands. Do the cell. Stop it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Guys. Yeah, over the top shot. This girl. The the division between them. This girl. With their hands together. She's gonna be something. This girl's so fucked up in the head, but she knows shit. (sighs) Henry's like, there's only five viable females, and they all hate me. (laughs) I I was trying to find out everything I could about you. So when I escaped, I have something to give them. You're her daughter. Finally talking. Does that not matter? What about our missing people? I can't think of a reason she'd keep them alive. Think she's being honest. She got a camp somewhere. Maybe a mile east. Wow. Is any of it true? I needed it to be. But I had it all mixed up. It was the mom. I knew what she was. I knew what she did. She's got the answer. Wow, she's being so raw and honest. You're right. It was different. I called it. Someone else got it. Not... Oh, the wrong guy! Did he Are you just... kidding? He just hit the guy that was getting bit. Yeah, no one knows what's happening. She sees an opportunity here. Did Stay she out. stage a coup? I don't think so. I think Mayhem just broke oh, out. They're idiots. We got stuck with. They're panicking, and that's putting us in danger. Get up. We'll leave. No, no, no. God. And there she goes, she's like, opportunity. Oh, bitch! She's gonna kill him yep. herself. Whoa! Why are you doing that? Why are you lying? He was gonna keep the kid. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry, I wasted your time. And then she still stays in the cage. Why would a mom do that to a kid? Some people ain't meant to be parents. Yeah. Should get her some fresh clothes. I'm gonna talk to Tara. Daryl getting soft in his old age. Daryl, I'm glad you and my mom are friends. Aww. Mm-hmm. Called me an asshole last night, you moody little bastard. The next time you want to challenge one of my decisions, just do me a favor and come and talk to me about it. But I do know I don't want any more people to die. She's awesome. And that includes you guys too. Solid leader. Mm-hmm. Tara. Hmm. Whoa! Hello, guys. Walking. Do you see that? Do you see that? The right thing. Broad fucking daylight. Run. Run. What are you doing? Rock and walk. Why are you standing? What? 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 What prevents you from running? No. What are you doing? Fucking crank the alarm, dog. That's the, that's I think they're just coming to talk. That's, that's the mama. Mom. That's yeah. the mama. Fucking infinity belt buckle thing? Jeez. Skinny. Oh, God. Is that her? Yeah. Yeah. Is yeah. that an entire different actress? No, no, that's no, her. That's the same that's actress. solid makeup, bro. And she is skinny, you're right. She's way skinny. That's what the apocalypse does to you. I thought they just leave behind. Like. It's her daughter. I'm Alpha. Alpha? We only want one thing from you. And a mega. My daughter. Ah. 
The episode's called Omega. She's Alpha. But, the beginning and the remember? end. Hmm. When, uh, yeah, the alphas and the betas. I don't know what the fuck that was all. I don't know if this connects. There... We're back, baby. <laughs> oh, shit. All right. Y'all. I mean, if it connects, then I don't understand how. I mean, I don't understand how either, but I think we're supposed to be made to believe it connects, but those people don't seem to think yeah, it's technology. Yeah, I don't I'm sorry. What did you guys say? Remember <laughs> with, uh, what's her name? Lydia. No, not Lydia. Um, Anne? Oh. Yeah. Slash. Uh, trash what her, person. What was her trash person name? Uh Jadis. Jadis, Jadis. there is. Jadis. Jadis, she'd be on the phone with someone, and like, is it an alpha or a beta? <gasps> and now this lady walks up, and she's like, I am alpha. Oh, yeah. No, she said, was it an A or B? A or B. My bad. And we yeah. assumed it was alpha or beta, but that, who knows? But then, I think guys, don't fuck with my head like that. At one connected. point, I think that earlier in the season, he, she did say alpha instead of A, B. Something and like that. And that's what made us leave to believe that, so... Regar- that, that term was used before. I don't know if it's all meant to be, but damn, they're going to negotiate can, though. Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I, can I I'm Team Lydia now. You're Team Lydia. What? I like Lydia. I mean, I'm sorry. Clearly, she's a victim. Yeah, she's so, a victim. Like, okay, yes, thank okay. You, okay but that, there's she's a, been her. She's been like mentally like fucked with her whole life. She doesn't know what's right or wrong. Like when yeah, when when, Hen- when Henry took her out, she's like, "This is all not supposed to be here. It's not supposed to be like this." Her mom brainwashed her so bad yeah. to like believe that like civilization can never be again, yeah. like. Lydia In the apocalypse, I can't imagine if that person offers anything to our group that we don't already have. If she can't get her shit together in two weeks, she's out the fucking door. But yeah. like, you, what? You just like, her mom's an abusive person. She clearly it might be a good person. Like, you That's just kick her, mouth to feed for you just kick her out. It's the fucking apocalypse. Yeah. If you can't offer anything and all you are is a fucking liability on a daily basis, like, I'm going to start wondering why we keep you around. But, yeah. you know, th- but you heard Henry Darling growing bigger and bigger. I know. Yeah. And, I mean, they should make for it. I'm Already she like said, it. like, they're not going to come for me, and it's like... But, like, that's what she believed, though. Like, they moved locations and stuff. She didn't really think her mom was going to come for her. Her mom's I mean, yeah, mentally her psycho. Mom fucking psycho. Well, look, yeah. at the same time, if she's as compromised as you guys think she is, she could also be lying about this and also acting. Because the only thing that she's no. been doing is acting like a zombie this I entire know. time. Look, I'm just saying... Saying that just because she did, she's coming to and she's been crazy before and abused does not give her a pass I can, uh, on everything that she's done. Well, here's the thing. No, no, before, no, no. So, yeah, I'm sorry. sorry. No, go ahead. Uh, one sorry. thing, I'll let you go. Before, like, the last episode, you can see clearly she wasn't, like, not trying to give her information. She was, like, kind of, like, trying to deny the truth yeah. and lying blah, blah, And this last thing with Daryl, full on truth and the memory and the flashbacks and the tears and emotion in her voice, she was telling the truth here. I could tell. Yeah. Doesn't mean she can be compromised again. Her mom can fuck with her, but the point is, at the end of the day, she's mm. somebody you can easily mess with. I still don't trust her. I don't know her Yeah, so there's still wait, a reason to trust her. So, like, I obviously, like, would take all the things into account that she did before she, like, came out. So, like, it would still factor into my decision, like, if, you know, she stays or what we are going to do with her. But, like, you have to consider that as a, like, she's she's a young person. Like, she was born into this world. Like, she was, I don't know, probably, like, five years old. Yeah, she said, like, five or six. When when they were in that fucking dank, dank house basement. Yeah. And... Her mom clearly is a fucking psycho. She was leading that... that I, I'm assuming that they had a bigger crowd and you can see how many people it is now. Like, those people that came to the gates, I believe that's all. Probably. It was like maybe under 20 people. So, she's Negan times 10. Oh like, my God. That's how beautiful <laughs> that, that person is. And you, like, Lydia definitely deserves a chance. You know what I mean? Even 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 if she fucks up and like does something bad, she's still a fucking minor right yeah. now. Yeah, I, I she think, abused oh, her sorry. kid and, and and killed some people, but she is not Negan times ten. I'm, I'm gonna stick with the Negan's the worst. Yeah. Al- the Al- worst. Al- I don't know about Alpha, Alpha yeah, but yes. I think, uh, there was a lot of kids in this show that grew up the right way in the apocalypse, and I guess she's an example of you know if if you were taught all the wrong you know, immoral ways to survive. Yeah. yeah. And uh, so I, I kind of feel for her that way. Good call on the flashbacks not being entirely truthful. Yeah. 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 yeah, we noticed some shit. I don't know about that, but then, oh. Because when they showed the first frame of her dad falling, it was different. Way different, yeah. yeah. When the zombie bit him, so I was like, this is that And then I think that part was super interesting because it kind of fucks with you on like how memories play back because mm-hmm. essentially... Every time you remember something, you're not remembering Change that something. thing. You're remembering the last time you remembered it. And that's why, like, memories get weirder and weirder and weirder memories over time. Change the color of the room. But, you know, yeah. that's, that's what also, All that, what's that that's what also that makes me back. believe that maybe she wasn't lying, like, willingly. Yeah, I yeah, feel yeah. like she believed it, but, like, as she was coming back to it, talking to them, yeah. she came to the realization that it was all... 
something that she was made to believe. By it's her probably mom. the first time she's ever had to talk about it because she's yeah. been in a fucking cult yeah. essentially, and she's like one hundred percent brainwashed. And like that she, part she was, was in interesting. Survival mode too, and I think yeah. Yeah. Maybe as stupid as it was when he took her out, I think it oh. did. I would still, I would still beat his ass for that. Uh, yeah, yeah I because that, I appreciate you're endangering the whole yeah. fucking community yeah. over one yeah. person. Yeah, and that's what and he like, tends to do. Like, like he's a kid too. Yeah. So he's like, I get it that he's, he's like an idealistic or idealistic youngster, but in, I just like to believe that in the apocalypse, that even as teenagers, we wouldn't still function 100% as yeah. teenagers yeah. because, like, it's survival. I mean, humans throughout history, but, like teenagers during fucking World War II or teenagers during the Cretaceous period, I know humans didn't exist back then, but you can make point. <laughs> it's not like they were being teenagers yeah. to an extent that they were just like sacrificing everybody but and like the, throwing out all the survival instincts. But, but, but at the same time, I feel like there's a common theme in the show with young people yeah. showing the way and kind of being the symbols of hope. You know what I mean? Because they're just like, uh, I mean, they don't yeah. have that fear of adults and like the precaution. So they risk more and then because they risk more, they reap the rewards more. When do I don't know when they ever reap the rewards. They've reaped a lot of things, and well, it's usually Well, I mean, the everything rewards. started Carl, changing Carl for the Kanye better because of Carl. Judith. Like Community. Carl was so idealistic that he changed the values of the entire. Community. But he was a lot. He was a lot wiser than Henry. Henry okay, is Henry, like the one hundred percent naivety. Like, obviously, he grew up, like, obviously, but like entirely. he will get there too. You know what I mean? It's just yeah. like part of growing up. And I like right. that. I like that this show gives like the kids <clears throat> this amount of power. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. By so the way, why, Carl. I think was supposed to have Henry's storyline if he was still alive. Yeah. Oh, like, wow. mm-hmm. I can see that. This place. Yeah. Why? Yeah. I have a question. Why did Lydia's mom like? What do you guys call that thingy? Alpha. Whip her. Whip her. Oh, with the, with the we switch. hit her with the switch. Switch her. Switch. Yeah. Switch. 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 Fucking spank her ass. Teach her lessons. I, I, because in the fucking apocalypse, like she'd be like, "Hey, every time you fuck up, I need to hurt you so that you know that when you fuck up for real, you're just gonna die." Oh, uh, and that's why she said, yeah. "If you're soft, you're not gonna survive." Yeah. Well, also since they don't like to live in a camp, they don't have belts and other stuff. They just like, "Where's the where's the tree? Here's a branch." <laughs> also, if you never got hit with a switch, you're missing out. I never got hit by a switch. Think. My buddy's God, grandma next door. She would braid switches. She'd get three of them bitches and braid them up. And just... <laughs> Damn. In Jordan, we had a game where you'd lay a belt real quick. Lay a belt in the street and you stand in line. Everybody has to run to the belt. You grab it and then whoever has the belt, you go stop hitting people. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Does this game have a name? I forgot what it's called in Arabic. Somebody please tell me. I know some Arabs out there. I know it's like... Sh- 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 uh, I think something. old school India was also the same way. If you were late or you got a question wrong or you weren't paying attention, you could like put your hands on the table. And then they... Oh, oh yeah, in Jordan, yeah. in Jordan they did that. Not in my I got school. Smacked in the hands. Like, were you? Yeah. yeah. They're like, show me. Oh yeah, you told me that teacher. <laughs> yeah, I just no. got paddled straight in the ass with one of them like Alpha Omega boys from like uh, the ones that you get when you pledge. Yeah. Our fucking principal used to have one of those wrapped in duct tape with holes in it. <laughs> Wait, like a paddle? Yeah. Like a paddle. Oh, damn. It was rough. <laughs> I didn't have any of that from like my education system. That was, yeah. I had that elsewhere. Strictly at home? Yeah. yeah. I wasn't really fucked up at school. I was real good at home. That being said, guys. That being said. Uh, uh, the Lydia shit's crazy. Seeing zombies out in the fucking daylight just. Hurt, 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 hurt. Yeah, they just yeah. locked right up. Like, one of them's got a fucking latte oh. in here. Like. <laughs> I forgot what the so death girl's name is, but she's hiding on the cornfield, so I don't. I wonder why. Oh my god. Why wouldn't she just speed up? Well, maybe they thought it was an attack with like ranged weapons. She could, like, maybe, maybe they were like, like one out by one out. Okay. Well, they, up to this point, they've only impressed me with their. Like, they're like. They've been really good at defending themselves, making smart decisions, and and I get that this whole part the of the group thing. thing. Yeah. But this is the dumbest thing that they did. They left two people out in the yeah. woods just because they said, "No, we'll be fine. It's dark. No one can see. They were just attacked the by zombies." But Tara sent impeti- like, bodyguard, some guards after. Like, that, I mean, right, the whole right, impetus right, of them going Thank out God. was because they're ride or die and they don't leave anybody behind. Walking Dead does it sometimes. You motherfuckers can fight me on it. They make people make dumb decisions that you don't think they would usually make. Yeah. Just yeah. for the sake of story. I do but literally, that. nothing really even came of this. Which is like, yeah. dumb. Yeah. Like, like, I just I didn't mean, know. Why yeah. would they you? came to the realization that it no, was dark. No, but they didn't dark. Yeah, they, they came back because it was dark. You knew it was dark when you were leaving the camp. <laughs> and why did you come up to the conclusion? Hey, when hey, hey, it hey, was and Alpha and them were watching them, so they followed them back to camp. That was just a more simple mistake. So, like, legitimately, and, like, I... I'm telling you guys are gonna be like, mm, no crab is in there. That, that doesn't make sense for them to do. For them to get out there in the woods and be like, oh, we didn't really have a plan. Like, you guys survived this far. Like, you would obviously go out with a plan. And then it'd be like, 
I can't not leave, so I'm going to stay out here. And then for the other ones, we'll be like, well, okay. We made a big deal about coming out here to find Luke because we're yeah. fucking ride or die. And now we're just going to leave you out here? Mm-hmm. That doesn't make fucking sense. You know, yeah. they were all hyped up on adrenaline. Like, let's go find <laughs> Luke's our boy, ride or die. And then when they, you know, what, right, once you go yeah. out there, yeah, it's yeah, a lot worse. Yeah, like, they got okay, out there, they're like, like I don't know, boss. Day. This was a bad idea. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm surprised that, I mean, I, I thought they had solid survival skills. And I mean, I guess they do, but... They dropped the ball this one time. Maybe it was just this one time. Yeah, it's just... Yeah, it, 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 it feels forced. Like, the characters... Like, IRL, they wouldn't do yeah, that. That was the one yeah. thing this episode I felt weird. I did enjoy the flashbacks, though. and like the, yeah. the, the subtle moments about Carol when she's not even on screen. Oh, yeah. yeah. That I, broke my heart about her home. Yeah. Yeah. I do like how uh, we were able to pick up on those things. Because we were like, yeah. wait, he, ha- he doesn't have a scissor cap, but she does now. Yeah. And, and things like that. It, yeah. it was... Like, we didn't know until you said that that might be... Like, what yeah, because the, the time jump was fucking weird. It was, it was. like, I was like, hold on, like, they're not gonna make this big of a glare mistake. It was state. an interesting mm-hmm. transition. We smart, like, he called her, like, yeah, we did good. We smartish, right? yeah. good. Like, he was like, bitch. And so, like, it was posing, <laughs> it was like, he was getting poised as, like, the typical. Yeah, yeah. everybody's gonna make fun of us now. Typical. The scissors, yeah. the scissors, yeah. 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 Oh, shit, and you know what? AJ, everybody's gonna make fun of us for noticing one thing now. They're like, oh, Daryl, Daryl even said it. He was like, the type of dad you're describing doesn't sound like. He was like, you know, it's the type of dad that wants you scared. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, the, the type of person that likes him when you're scared, but, like, not the type of dad that would sing to you. Like, Daryl was realizing, like, the inconsistencies in her story mm-hmm. because Daryl, I think he was... Well, he said it before that his dad, like, beat on him, right? Yeah. He said yeah. that to uh, Beth, Brittany? What was it? Beth. 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 <laughs> I said Brittany. Couldn't even remember, but whenever they're 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 together, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, and one last thing is their whole mindset, like, Lydia's mindset kind of reminds me when Rick and the group first came to Alexandria because yeah. they were like the outsiders were like these walls are ridiculous you guys are ridiculous for thinking like you can actually sustain that's right and Rick was an asshole yeah <laughs> so I guess this is what would happen if Rick and the crew never you know acclimated yeah. to this Alpha. Yeah. you remember when uh, what was her name the, uh, the lady who ran Alexandria and like yeah, Rick essentially yeah. put himself in a position where he's gonna have to shoot that motherfucker in the head yeah she was like do it Rick and he's like I've been waiting for this he turned <laughs> like less than a second just Right, like he was God. So yeah, all right, I get that too. That's a yeah. good. That's a good parallel. When yeah. you're out there for so long, like it fucks with you. Yeah. It really like it changes yeah. like who you are, it changes your humanity, it changes what you have to do for survival, and I think it changes the expectations you have of the world because you can't live like a crazy wildling zombie person and also know that living inside a community is an option. Yeah, because what, that's racist against wildlings. <laughs> so, I, I, I feel like this would be like a really good time to start like writing down some laws because you have a very small community that you can like micromanage and they take examples writers, from every writers. time you have somebody in prison like like no one's allowed in the basement except for x y and z not just yeah, yeah. not just but, henry but, with but his then also like for, for, for like the future like if this example happens again this is the process mm-hmm. yeah you know yeah. I mean? yeah yeah you should Cool. Solid, solid up, y'all. Yeah, another like, one. You know. Yeah. Well, well, kinda, I wonder if they go out, if she'll ever tell them, hey, I almost killed you with a hammer, but then the baby cried. Yeah. Probably not. That's <laughs> a... <laughs> you don't, you don't, oh, you don't he ate a worm and she ate a worm. Oh, my God, the worm part. She, like, she stripped she the dirt off Yeah, right? <laughs> mm. oh. Is that like... That's foreplay, right? Yeah. That's foreplay. Oh, That's foreplay. my God. Worms are uh, aphrodisiac. Look, I, well, she's putting the imagery in my head of just sucking Ooh. the dirt off a worm. <laughs> okay, yes. On that note, suck the dirt off let us know yeah. in the comments what you guys thought about this episode. Yeah, yeah. let us know your thoughts. So Would you wrong. suck the dirt off a worm? <laughs> For a girl, I ate a worm when I was a kid. I mean, I was a kid though. Would yeah? Would would you have eaten the worm? Okay, let's say she's your age, super smoking hot. Yeah. Would you have eaten the worm? No. Yeah. 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 One more time. Yeah. Yeah. If it was Count Drogo, I wouldn't do that. Damn. Oh God. See you, bro. Bye, y'all. Bye. Oh, thank you, Ron. Oh, thank you, Ron. I'll thank you. Marquette, did not set it up. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry, set it up? Is this? Oh, it is. Never mind. I don't know anymore, guys. You're here. Aren't you here? AJ's not on that now. I don't know. Not that, not that they drew you. I think that's you. That? Yeah. I think so? No. Yeah. That's you, Maddie, and Bo. Are you sure? Or you, Maddie, and Mikey or something. Yeah, yeah. That's that's AJ's dude. Oh, my God. That is Asian. Yeah, that is Asian. <laughs> that, that is Asian. Asian. <laughs> <laughs> Hey everybody, thank you so much for joining us again for another exciting episode of The Walking Dead. What's your opinion of Season 9? I think it's actually been pretty solid so far all the way through. Once again, a big shout out to all of our super patrons, Luis, Joe Max, Marky O, Keyboard Junkie, NYR Fan, and Philip. 
We will see you guys next week for more Walking Dead.